Oh, man. <clears throat> I'm just going to start, and if anybody comes in, they come in. What's going on, y'all? What's going on, cold? Welcome. I'm just here giving a little update on my 24-hour hold on. I'm just here giving an update on my 24-hour water fast and what's been going on. So, I started my water fast. Um, I started it last last night. I think like 10, 10, 30, I think about, I think about, I think about 10. And I said I wanted to do something like at the end of every month, in the very month, um, have a water fast, just like an end of the month cleansing thing. No, nothing really in particular, just you know, just to just give my body a chance to relax and kind of uh, flush out and cleanse all, well, you know, some of the crap I've been putting in my body, like all the sugars and stuff I've been putting in my body, all the bad foods I've been eating. Always good to fast and get it out of your system. So, I only do it for one day. Um, I've done it before. I, I did it like maybe like sometime last year. I did it. Well, I tried doing. I tried doing a twenty-five water fast for the first time, and I did a video about it. And I spoke about how how, how my body felt, how my mind felt, how I felt overall, like what I learned about myself and all that, and. I said, I said, if I ever get a chance to, I want to do it again. Like, for the new year, I wanted to do it again to kind of make it a habit for myself. So, I said, okay, when should be the best time to do it? I thought about doing, like, the first month of, the first month, the first day of every month. I said, you know what? I want to do the last day of every month so I can kind of, like, start the new month fresh. I said, okay, I'm going to do, do the last day of every month. So, today's the 31st. I started it last night. And because I've already done a water fast, I kind of know what to expect. And I kind of know what to do to deal with some of the issues I had. My first water fast, like those, those hunger pains. <sighs> I noticed that. I don't really have. I should don't think. I don't think I had any. I don't think I really had any hunger pains. This time that I did the first time I tried. The first time I tried, I had hunger pains like crazy. They were just coming up on, like, creeping up on me, like when I wasn't even in the refrigerator. I wasn't even in the kitchen. I would catch a hunger pain. But this time I've I've dealt with it better. Um, woke up feeling. I woke up feeling good. Uh, I had to I had to wake up and remind myself, okay, don't eat anything, don't eat anything, and make sure I had enough water. That's why you see water here. Um, let's see what else? Um, <clears throat> I had to make sure that you know I the last meal that I did have before I started my started my fast was a pretty good you no. Know, hefty meals so my body could have something to feed off of as I'm fasting. And I think that was a smart idea because I had a pretty good I had a pretty good meal uh last night and it's that's I, I guess that's helping me deal with these hunger pains because I haven't I haven't had any hunger pains. Uh let's see what time is it? It is four thirty eight in the afternoon so I am about so eleven eleven to eleven is twelve hours so I'm sorry ten to ten is twelve hours so 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4. So I am about eight, 18, I'm 18 hours into my fast. Also, what I did was actually help me. Um, I started my fast before, you know, before I went to bed. So, you know, when you fast, you go to sleep anyway. That's what I call a break. When you break your fast, the first thing you eat is called a breakfast. That's what I call a break fast breakfast. So, I had a good meal before I went to bed. Uh, I had a good sleep. I had to wake up, you know, get myself together. But I still had a had a, had a meal on me. Uh, been drinking my water. 
you know, keeping plenty of water next to me. Um, I would say, I almost slipped up. I almost slipped up and ate something. I almost slipped up. It happened earlier today. Earlier today, uh, like, early in the morning. Early in the morning. I, I, I was uh, I was taking the trash out. I was taking the trash out and all that stuff. And I came back in, washed my hands, and I was about to make myself a sandwich. I was about to. I grabbed the bread. I went to the refrigerator, grabbed the bread, and as soon as I grabbed the bread, my brain said no. And I immediately put it back. I said, whew, almost, almost got me. I almost broke. I almost messed up and forgot about it and broke. See that that right there. That's what I noticed about the the fast is that those hunger pains for me they weren't just like just blatant, just crazy hunger pains. They were subtle. They were all of a sudden just like you know your brain would just say it was like it was like it was almost like a, a natural reflex, like like a reflex to go grab something to eat. It was a reflex. So, I just quickly just grabbed it, I was like, put it back. Like, as soon as I grabbed it, my brain said, put it back. And I put it back immediately. I said, whew, almost caught me. You almost, you almost broke. But I didn't break. I haven't broken. That was the only time I could think of that the thought of eating crept into my brain. Like, there was... There was leftover food from yesterday, and I said, "Okay, I'm not going to touch it." I, I didn't. I didn't even think about it. There was cheesecake in the refrigerator, and I, I love me some cheesecake. Ooh, do I love me some cheesecake? But every time I saw it, I didn't even think about it. I didn't even think about the cheesecake. I didn't think about the leftover food. None of that. I didn't think about eating a bowl of cereal. Nothing. Only to my books when I say I'm about to grab, I'm about to make me a sandwich. I grab the bread and I, my brain says stop, so I put the bread back. Only, the only time I felt that urge. That was the only time I could think I felt the urge. But do I feel? I don't. I don't feel weak. My the first time I did, the first time I did a 25 hour water fast, I was feeling weak. I was feeling like you know, I call it shakes where you know your body, like your body's used to eating a certain amount, so when you don't, your body gets feel the shakes and all that stuff. But I didn't feel it. I didn't. I didn't feel the shakes. I didn't feel weak. Um, let's see what else? I was able to do the same thing as I, I always did. Um, work out and all that stuff, and work and my art and all that stuff. I was able to do all that without feeling any stress, no hunger pains or anything. So that was that was good to feel. Uh, let's see, what else? Um, like I said, the first time I did it, it test it, for me, it tested my motivation. It tested my determination. But now that, now that I know how my body feels and what my brain went through during the first time I did a water fast, I noticed that my brain was quicker to process what was going on than the than the last time. Cause like the first time I did it, my brain didn't know what to do, other than do what it naturally would do, which is like send signals to say, "Okay, eat, eat, eat." But I had to I had to trick my brain to say, "No, we we're fasting." I had to I had to trick my brain into saying we're fasting. But this time, when I made up my mind that I was going to do a water fast. It's it's, it's 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 almost like my brain said, okay, we're doing the water fast. I know what to do now. I've learned from the last time. My brain was like, I know what to do now for this particular water fast. We're going to make the night. We're going to make the necessary adjustments for your body and your mind, so you can kind of deal with some of the issues you had last time. Either you will deal with them better, or it won't happen at all because my brain will know what to do. Um, benefits of a water fast. Um, you get a chance to you know get out a lot of stuff, you know a lot of waste that's in your body. Plus, you drink a water, so your water helps 
soften up your stool and all that stuff. So when you go to the bathroom to do a, a, a bowel movement, it won't be all hard. It won't be all painful and constipated. So that helps. Um, your urine goes back to being clear. I will say that much. Before I did my fast, like the the day before I did my fast, my urine was all yellow and all that stuff. Cause I, I was eating, I was eating and drinking bad, you no know, junk food and sodas and all that stuff. The quickest way to turn your 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 urine yellow and all that stuff is just drink some soda. But the moment I started my water fast, and the moment I started drinking water, the very moment I started drinking water, I went to the bathroom. It started to change. It go from you know from lighter, lighter, lighter to now it's clear. So it's clear now. Still is. Um, your body odor changes. I noticed that too. I noticed that with the last one, but I'm now aware of it now that I was when I first did the water fast. Your body odor changes because you know they say uh, you are what you eat. So if you eat junk and you eat mess, you know, you the more junk you eat, it comes out in it comes out in your it comes out in your breath, it comes out in your pores and your sweat. So even when you take a shower, if all you're doing is eating junk food, even if you take a shower, you still you still it still comes out. That's that 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 junk food still comes out in your in your body even after you take a shower. So but once you do once you do a fast, even for twenty five, once you do a fast, you can see the difference. You can smell the difference. Like your your, your the morning breath isn't as strong uh when you're doing the when you're when you're fasting. Because if all you're doing is eating junk food and drinking soda and all kinds of processed foods and all that stuff, that morning breath is boofing. That morning breath will put a jab to you. But when you do the water fast, the first thing I noticed that when I did my water fast is that my morning breath wasn't as strong. Wasn't as strong. Which is a good thing. Uh, let's see what else. I say your 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 body odor isn't as pungent. I say you are what you eat. So if you're eating junk food, that's what's gonna come out in your pores. That's what's gonna come out in your sweat and your armpits and all that stuff. Um, the more water you drink, uh, the healthy healthier your skin looks. You know, it don't look all dry and all that stuff and dehydrated. You are you are properly hydrating yourself. So yeah, let's see what else. My endurance. Uh, for those who don't know, every morning, every morning, I go out for my morning run. I run around the complex every day, and I've been doing this for the past like four hundred and four hundred and something consecutive days since like middle of last year, I believe. And what I noticed that. You know, when you're eating, when you're eating junk food, you're eating processed foods and all that stuff, and drinking sodas and all that, my endurance suffered a little bit. There'll be moments where you know there there's some days where I'm moving pretty fast, moving with some energy. Then the days I'm just sluggish and I just I I, I can't even get to full speed like I used to. But I noticed that um, this morning when I woke up and I went for my morning run while I'm doing my my, my uh, fast. I felt my endurance immediately change. It, it immediately increased. And I was like, okay. Like, cause like, like what, what a difference 24 hours make. And I'm still not done with the water fast, but what a difference 24 hours make. So, and like, it's, it's, it's things like that. Like, small little details like that. That, to me, are, were easily recognizable. From my last fast, and I even even right now as as we speak, I'm feeling the hunger hunger pains a little. I'm feeling the little little growl in my stomach, you know, the little growl. I'm feeling it, but my first water fast, when I feel these little growls in my stomach. 
like my whole body felt like it was just was going like shut down. Like I was going to like, just like I want to go to sleep. And there are moments still where I feel like I'm, I feel sleepy. I still feel that sometimes, but not as not as much as my first time. But now, even as I'm feeling, I'm feeling a little grub, uh, grumbles in my stomach now. They're not affecting me as strongly as the last time because I could just get the water, and my body won't know what to do. Another thing, gas. When you burp, when you pass gas, flatulence, fart, poop, whatever you want to call it, or when you burp out your mouth, the smell isn't as strong. I think everybody knows when you eat meat and when you eat, you know, just processed foods and all that stuff. When you pass gas, when you go to the bathroom, you know, to, you know, bowel movement, the smell is a lot, a lot lot stronger. I noticed that whenever I have, you know, when I got past gas, when I burp, like when I, when I burp, all I'm smelling is water. Like, like oh, I won't to say smell water, but it has a kind of a clean smell to it. As opposed to when I was drinking soda and all that stuff, like just 24 hours ago, <laughs> when I burp, you could just smell this, like, it's like that funky, acidic smell that come right back to your nose. Same thing when you pass gas. Same thing. So those little those little changes I noticed that the first time I did my water fast. <clears throat> see? It just burped and nothing. But before when I burped, oh I it 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 felt it felt wrong. Anyway. Let's see what else. Um obviously losing weight and stuff, you know. I said losing mass because that's the way you lose a mass. Um, well, drinking water stuff helps you flush out stuff. So what else? 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 Uh, that's pretty much it. So, you know, like I said, it's something that I do that I want to get in the habit of doing at the end of every month. So, be ready for the end of February for another video. So, this is this the first video. Actually, second video I've done on the fast, but the first end of the month water fast video. So, hope you enjoy it, and hopefully you learn something. Anybody want to try it or ask questions about it, it's fine. Leave a comment. I will catch you all later. Peace.